Today I'm going to change the oil on a Honda Elite 80 scooter. The scooter reached a thousand miles yesterday and the oil needs to be changed. It's supposed to be changed every thousand miles. And when the odometer rolls every thousand miles, this little indicator, this little green indicator for the engine oil turns red. And in order to reset that little thing, you just take your key in this little opening and press down and that little indicator resets, resets itself back to green. So yeah, this is the first time I ever changed the oil on this, on this thing since I got it. And um, I have a manual and the manual tells you to remove the drain plug which is um, right there. There's a little hex head and it's a 5 16 inch, inch Allen wrench on here. And I made myself a little Polish drain pan here. I uh, took a milk jug and I cut the top off. And I angled it a little bit so that way it fits underneath. And the screw is loosened and let's uh, loosen the drain plug and drain oil now. oil looks a little black but it looks like it's clean also so let this let, let so let's let this oil drain well the oil's all drained now let's screw the plug back in here's the plug take our uh, allen wrench and just screw it and tighten it Got it. Perfect. Now let's uh, refill it. Well, in order to refill the crankcase up with oil, first you got to remove the oil level uh, plug, this plastic thing. You unscrew it. See, there's a little dipstick on it, and you add oil to this to refill it. And since this is a really tight area, I had to get a funnel with a flex. So I'll put the funnel right in there, right in the hole. And I'm not exactly sure how much oil came out of here. I'm guessing close to a quart. And the and the manual told you to use a uh, 10W40 oil, so that's what I'm going to be using. And I'm not going to add the full quart. I'm just going to add just a tad bit under, just to be safe. So let's uh, add the oil. a little bit at a time. Garbage picked funnel. It's great to find garbage picked things to use. Okay. A little slow filling it up. Just a swig more. Yeah, that should do it for now. Now let's uh, put the cap back on, run the engine, and check the oil. Keys are in, let's start the engine. Hold the brake in, make sure it's on run. Now let's let it, let it run for two minutes. I guess now it's time to shut the engine down. 
Make sure the key is off. Now let's check the oil level again to make sure it's uh, level enough to make sure that it ain't over done. Wipe it off. Put it back in, screw it in. Unscrew it and then we can check the oil level. Perfect. It's supposed to stay within the uh, margin. It ain't supposed to go up this little thimble here where I got my finger. It's supposed to stay on the stick. So, yeah, now the oil has changed. And I added almost a quart of oil. I added just enough, maybe three quarters of a quart, until there was maybe uh, eight ounces left. And that concludes this video, and I sure hope you enjoyed it. Bye.